हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू बड़वान मॉडल स्कूल वर्चुअल क्लासेस और ऑनलाइन क्लासेस सी लर्निंग क्लासेस आई होप यू ऑल आर सेफ फ्रॉम दिस पेंडेमिक सिचुएशन मेंटेनिंग द लॉकडाउन टुडे आई एम टेकिंग योर कंप्यूटर क्लास दिस इज योर फर्स्ट क्लास ऑफ क्लास सेवन I think you all are waiting for my video or for my class. That's why I'm here with you. So let's start. Today I will discuss about number system. A computer basically does not understand the languages we humans speak. Computer can only understand. Only two digits. That is zero and one. That is zero and one. This is expressed as binary number system. In number system, there are two types of number systems are basically here. So the first one is positional number system. And the next one is non-positional number system. So the number system is basically divided into two parts: that is, positional number system and non-positional number system. Positional number system are divided into binary number system. decimal number system and the last one is hexadecimal number system we can learn the details of binary number system octal number system. decimal number system and hexadecimal number system so number system is basically divided into two parts positional number system and non positional number system so the first one positional number system is divided into four types first one is binary number system octal number system decimal number system and the last one is hexadecimal number system and non positional number system there are many types of non positional number system for example bcd code Gray code, XS three code, etc. So number system is basically divided into two types. First one is positional number system, and the next one is non-positional number system. Positional number system are four types: binary number system, decimal number system. octal number system and the last one is hexadecimal number system non positional number systems are bcd code gray code xs3 code etc bcd the first one binary coded decimal bcd the first one binary coded decimal okay now come to the point first one is binary number system binary number system a number system which can take only two digits that is 0 and 1 that's why the base or radix of this number system is 2 so binary number system can take the digits 0 and 1 that's why the base or radix is 2 What is base or radix? Base is defined 
as the total number of digits available in the number system. Base is defined the total number of digits available in the number system. So, binary number system contain only two digits. That's why the base or radius of this number system is two. And next one, next one is octal number system. Total eight digits. That is zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's why the base or radius of this octal number system is eight. So the digits are zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So the base or radius of this number system is. Eight here and then next one is next one is decimal numbers. Next one is decimal numbers. Decimal number system contain ten digits. Decimal number system contain ten digits. The digits are zero, one, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, the base or radius of this number system is 8, that is 10. So, base or radius of this number system is 10. So, first one is binary number system. Binary number system contains only 2 digits, that is 0 and 1. That's why. The base or radius of this number system or of binary number system is 2. And then octal number system. Octal number system contain total 8 digits. That is from 0 to 7. That's why the base or radius of octal number system is 8. And then the decimal number system. Decimal number system contain total 10 digits. That is from 0 to that's why the base or radius of the particular decimal number system is 10. And then the next one, and the last one, last one is hexadecimal number system. Hexadecimal number system. Hexadecimal number system contain total 16 digits. Hexadecimal number system contain total 16 digits that is from 0 to 9 as numeric or number and from 10 to 15 as alphabetic order. So the digits are in hexadecimal number system 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, then 10. 10 will be present as A. Next one is 11, that is B. Next one is 12, that is C. Next one is 13, that is D. Next, 40, that is E. And last one is 15, that is A. So the digits are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. From 0 to 9, expressed as number or numeric. And from 10 to 15, those are represented as characters, character order. That means 10 represent as A, 11, B, 12, C, 13, D, 14, E, and also is 15. Clear? Clear? Okay. So, today, I will discuss about some brief introduction about number system. Number system is basically divided into two parts or two types that is positional number system and non-positional number system. Positional number systems are binary number system, octal number system, decimal number system and hexadecimal number system. Binary number system contain only two digits 0 and 1. 
that's why the base or radix of this number system is 2 and then octal number system octal number system for 10 0 to 7 total 8 digits that's why the base or radix of octal number system is 8 and then decimal number system decimal number system contain total 10 digits from 0 to 9 and then the last one is hexadecimal number system hexadecimal number system contain total 16 digits from 0 to 9 as number and from 10 to 15 are alphabetical 10 can be represented as a then 11b 12c 13g 14e and the last one 15 Clear? Okay. And the next one, what do you mean by base or radius? Base is defined as the total as the total number of digits available in the number system. So binary number system contain two digits, that's why base or radius of this number system is two. Octal number system contain eight digits. That's why the base or radius of octal number system is eight. Decimal number system contain how much digits? 10 digits. That's why the base or radix of decimal number system is 10 and hexadecimal number system contain total 16 digits from 0 to 15. That's why the base or radix of hexadecimal number system is 16. So for example, suppose x of y. That means suppose you can write 23 base. 10. That means x is the particular number and y is the base. That means 23, 2 or 3 is in which form is in decimal number system. Clear? So x of y, x is the particular number and y is the base. So 23 is in decimal form. Okay. I will discuss about all details of number system and their conversion, how to convert decimal numbers to binary number system, binary to decimal number system and more so on. So till then, thank you, stay home, stay safe.